tell me about some of the L2 security measures. So L2 security, sir, at layer, uh, at layer 2, we have basically port security. At layer 2, we have switches as a device which works on layer 2. So uh, layer 2, to prevent our switches, we have a port security concept. What is a port security? In the port security, what basically we can do is that if, like, let's consider we have a topology. With that topology, I, my, PC, my PC is connected with a switch. And I want that uh, every day uh, my switch will uh, connect with the same LAN port which is connected with the same switch interface. So for that, with what, what I can do is that I can bind my MAC address of my device to that particular interface of the switch. And I will configure switch port on that, uh, on uh, port security on that switch interface. So basically what happens when someone else wants to, uh, wants to connect his own device with that particular LAN port, so at that time, that switch will learn that it's a different MAC address which is not statically bind with me. So it will trigger the, whenever switch will receive a request from a different MAC address, it will trigger the port security violation. And at that time, my switch port goes in the error disable state and it will turn off the interface. If we have configured the teasing time, then it will automatically come up. And if we are, if we are not configured with, if the switch is not configured with easing time, for that, we have to manually shut down the port and then we have again run a command to uh, no shut command to turn up the port switch port. So basically, this is the security measures we can do at our layer 2. 